Number four, Brian Sager. Darling, darling, it is uh, Sunday, April 11th. Um, so I do my check-ins on Sundays. No heroes, villains, one to blame While we'll did roses fill the stage And the thrill, the thrill is gone Our you was a masterpiece But in the end for you and me Hope this show can't go on We used to have it all But now's our curtain call So hold for the applause Oh, 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 oh Wave out to the crowd. Come on. Take our fight back. Oh, it's our time to go. But at least Alright, so today is a high carb day. So it's the past two days have been low carb days. Alright, so we got our last two meals of the day here. But yeah, that's pretty much been it. Um that's the full day of eating. Uh just under five and a half weeks out now. Wednesday and Thursday, uh, nothing on Friday, and Saturday show day. All right, guys, so I just got to the venue. It's at the Delta Hotel in downtown St. John's. Uh, so I just got a bunch of my stuff here. I'm going to bring up to the room and then just kind of chill for a bit, go register, get my number, and um, get my trunks and everything, all that checked. Um, the regular kind of registration stuff and the athletes meeting is actually virtually so we're probably gonna all chill in some hotel room and watch it on the uh, on one computer and um, I got a meal with me and then I got one more meal my last meal is a burger and fries so I'm pretty excited for that and uh, then that's it one more sleep until show day so I'll uh, I'll check back in with you guys when I get in there Hello. what's up guys clash of the channel <laughs> <laughs> let's see the view uh, this is actually a sick view. I know, it's really nice. Are you vlogging? Going to registration. <laughs> Let's go. Gang, gang. Oh, the cake top? Nice. It's vintage, baby. Shout out Steve. Do you think Steve watches my videos? <laughs> I highly doubt Steve watches any videos. Oh my god, look at you. There's only two of them. I actually feel like they're really good. Um, it's gonna be sick ankles, girl. <laughs> 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 Employer workplace. What is that? I don't have to feel that idea. Oh. Employer workplace? Really? Oh. November 1st. Oh. 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 No, I'm just getting into the sign here. I'm going to change the date. Just a little bit. Sure thing, Matthew. Forgot my hat. Oh, that's cool. Got my music. So I gotta go up and get my music now. Going down. Yeah, so I had to put my music on um, a USB drive, and so they're just going to kind of play from that. You just kind of pick the minute from the song that you want, and, uh, and I guess they plug it into the computer and play it. But uh, anyways, one thing I had to remember, if I forgot, of course, is what it is. All right, so we're just back from registration. Got our number, number four. Fun fact, that was my first number in hockey. So that's, uh, that's definitely good luck right there. Sorry, what was that? Oh, never mind. Never mind. Um, they didn't check my, my trunks or anything. They checked she your... She told me, she was like, your, your bikini seems kind of small. Oh, really? I was like, and then Carly was like, they had pro cut at Atlantics apparently last weekend. And I was like, are you saying that cake? <laughs> um, yeah, but um, weighed in at 184.6 with my clothes on. So I guess I'm down weight, I don't know. Um, the scale is also different, so that's probably why. Um, yeah, so just have my other meal. Um, gonna watch the athletes meeting, get my tan, have my burger, and then go to sleep. So that's that. That's the update. Very exciting. Also got my goodie bag. Um, got like a shirt, uh, protein bar, a few other little things. So that's cool. 
Um, it's from Supplement King, and yeah, that's that. So I'll uh, I'll see you guys after my tan. All right. So basically, we're ordering our last meal. We're ordering um, burgers and fries from Jack Astor's, and Luke orders it, but he orders it to his house. So then we had to dart down here to Jack Astor's from the Delta, and trying to beat the skip the dishes guy. And Luke ended up finding him and like calling out to him from the car or <laughs> from the side of the road to his car. And he was like, hey, Lintos. And uh, anyways, got skipped the dishes. Um, Linto yeah. was a legend. He was. Mind you. What a legend. He was I literally went into Jack Astor's, didn't see a skip the dishes guy in there. I was like, shit. So I looked at the app and it said Linto was driving to your location, but the car was still at Jack Astor's. So I go outside. I'm like, man, I'm looking for like a guy that looks like named Linto. And I see this guy pulling out of the parking lot with a mask on his beard. Yeah. And I was like, hey, are you Linto? <laughs> and he stops. And, he, and I go over, I'm like, I'm Luke with your skip the dishes order. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, we're happy campers here now. That could that could have been a lot worse. Yeah. That could have been a lot that would that like went as good as it could have went. Absolutely. Yeah. Rather nice. Give me some salt too, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you Last meal. Meal. That was an adventure. Oh, I'm missing is my chicken strips, so I'm okay. Mm. Fuck yeah. Ben, did I lay my phone down there? Last meal, the night before the show. Fries, burger. Friendship. Friendship. <laughs> Needs more ketchup. All right, guys, so as you can see, got the first coat of tan. The tans are actually so much better than my last show uh, that I competed at two years ago, so I'm really happy with that. Happy with how I'm looking. Um, destroyed that burger. That was delicious. And, um, yeah, now it's just time to get some sleep, wake up in the morning, and get the job done, right? So I'm super excited, uh, super happy, and just really looking forward to to get on stage with some friends tomorrow. So it's gonna be good. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Birds flying high. You know how I feel. Sun in the sky. You know how I feel Yeah, so um, we just finished pre-judging for natural classic physique and natural men's physique. Yes, dude. And relax. Um, so yeah, and now we got a bit of time, I think, before the open. So I'm also doing um, men's open physique and or men's open, yeah, men's open physique and men's class physique. Going down. Um, so just going to get some uh, some fuel here now, and uh, we'll head back downstairs. Show them the VIP pass. Process. Can you get good angles on this? Can you work much comp after this, dude? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> John, John's knees are bad. <laughs> Pan girl. <laughs> so dry dude. Dude, this is gonna be the first sip of anything that I had since like yesterday too. All right, there you go. Good job. Can't wait to later, bro. Dude, I gotta do that all over again for class. Dude, my mask. Dude. 
and time. Okay, your number 23, Jesse Cooper. This is the last one. This is it. If you can make it around here, your race is done. But life doesn't wave a white flag. So then we wave our oh. white flag. Uh. Not even knowing that just around the next turn, just around the next sacrifice, just if you can make it through this season, just if you don't give up in this trial, See, the reason you can't stop is because you might be so close. Wouldn't it be a shame for you to quit when you're this close? Wouldn't it be a shame for you to walk away when you've come this far? Wouldn't it be horrible for you to bail out when you're just this close to victory? You can't walk by what you see. You can't give up because it doesn't feel good. You can't let people talk you out of it. You can't let your emotions stop you from moving forward. Keep believing. Keep moving. Keep marching. Keep crawling. Keep inching. This might be the day. This might be the one. This, this has to happen. Oh my god. I don't know what to go with first. Probably the original. Oh my god. That's so good. So this is the Kinder Bueno. I didn't even show you guys the last one, but look at that. Are you eating it? Yeah, I'm eating donuts. Hi. What's up? You missed all the clips of me. Were you crying? Um, I was trying not to, but it was it was apparent that I was on the verge. Oh, well, you know what? I think I have a good cry sometimes. I think I'm like the motivational speaker of your vlog. I feel like I'm gonna make the vlog. Mm -hmm. Subscribe to my channel. Don't. If you aren't already. Yes, bye. <laughs> I'm kidding, I feel like none of your subscribers subscribe to my channel, so. Taylor already has too many subscribers, so don't. I hit 7K today. I, did you actually? Yeah. I thought, last time I looked, you were at 4K. I hit 7K today. That's crazy. Here I am at 300. Hey, but it's also, it's a loyal to your channel on mine. It's a loyal 300. Yeah, subscribe. How long are you going to take a shower? Oh, I know. That's what my mouth is like. All right, me and Taylor are trying cookies here. Um, I can't talk to you because it's, it's 
<laughs> She's trying the peanut butter one. It was dry as shit. It was really uh, good though. It is really good. It's really peanut buttery. What are, what is this one? NL sea salt chocolate chip. Oh god. This one's probably the best one, honestly. Um, I don't think that we're gonna eat when we go out because yeah. we've just been having like snacks and stuff here. Probably have an authentic bar. Get the protein in. I have a bunch of authentic bars. Um, but yeah, um, so we're just gonna go out now. We're just having a few drinks here. And um, then we're gonna go out, mingle and stuff, and uh, enjoy the night. But yeah, this cookie's amazing. Um, mm -hmm. We definitely need water. All I've had is this monster and like one of those propels. You caught water too. Mm -hmm. And some. This is this is Gatorade. Okay, so I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna try. Um, I've had all this stuff before, and I feel like I'm gonna. I'm not gonna have one of these, but just okay. This is your first time having these, right? The, the Snicker ones, yeah. Yeah. So these are from the Postmaster's house, which is like a bed and breakfast, I think. But Snickerdoodle cookies, and they literally taste like Taylor said on her first first impression of the cookie. It tastes like like a soft dad's cookie, like covered in um, sugar, though. Because obviously like it's Christmas a snicker dough. Cookies, but like also like soft. Sure yeah, inside. yeah. So they're really good. Um, but yeah, that's probably gonna do it. I've honestly eaten a lot today already. I'm going out. Look at me. No, look at me. I said. Ah, uh, post show monster. It's what I have been waiting for. <laughs> uh, it's literally so good. I literally haven't eaten anything since the show too, and it's been like an hour and a half, so I'm already doing better than than last time. Um, but yeah, so I guess I'll um, I'll talk briefly about the um, about the finals. Um, so it didn't didn't go as I as I had hoped. Um, I got third place in um, classic physique, natural classic physique. Um, I got third place in natural men's physique, and I got third place in natural in open men's physique. And I did not place in uh, open classic physique. Um, so there was just top three, so they didn't do um, past the top three. Um, so yeah, I'm definitely, definitely disappointed. Um, but that's that's how this sport is, right? Um, you never know who's going to show up or how they're going to show up. Um, I literally showed up my best. Um, I couldn't have showed up better. Um, you know, I put on like 10 pounds of muscle since my last show and my conditioning was on point with the head judge even made a point of coming over to me and talking to me, um, after the show and, um, kind of, you know, told me a couple things that I need to work on. Um, she said I had the best conditioning out there. Um, she says that my posing was good and, um, you know, just moving forward, I think I just need to dial in on classic physique and kind of pick that because doing, doing the four classes today, um, it drained me and I was, I was honestly exhausted, just like mentally, physically exhausted today and, um, but you know, even tonight when I when I got to go out and um, and do my posing routine, I enjoyed every minute of that. Uh, that was so much fun, and um, 
yeah, so moving forward, um, probably just going to hop into an off season now. Um, the plan was to do nationals um, in the fall at the end of November, um, but I think it would almost be better off for me to go into a good off season and, you know, uh, put on size, work on my weaknesses, and go from there. I mean, that's, that's literally what this sport is about, um, you know, constantly getting better. And, you know, losing is what's going to, you know, make those victories taste so much sweeter. And, you know, you, you're never going to know what you need to improve on you know, if you don't lose, and I'm such a competitive person, and I don't think anybody hates losing as much as I do, um, but it's an individual sport, and, you know, losing is obviously part of it, and I gotta, you know, take this in stride, and, and take this in stride, and count it as a blessing, because, you know, this is going to be such a motivator for me moving forward. And if I had just walked off with a bunch of trophies and overalls, yeah, that would be great. Um, but I wouldn't be as hungry moving forward. So that's my update. I got three third place, um, or yeah, third place medals. Um, but yeah, no, I'm just, you know, pretty emotional, really grateful for for all my friends, um, especially Luke and Morgan and Taylor, um, and, you know, and just, uh, yeah, just gonna relax now, um, I'm just literally, like, I'm literally crying here because... I'm just exhausted and, um, you know, things didn't go my way and that's it, but, um, yeah, I'm just looking forward to getting better and that's what the sport's about, so, I just stopped fucking crying, um, but yeah, and I have, I have a bunch of treats here now that I can have that I haven't been able to have in 20 weeks, um, Oh yeah, one other thing, a good point that Taylor made that she just told me was, it was a small show, it was like 30 competitors, and she said like in one of her classes it was just her, and she said that, you know, yes, you know that you're going to win before you even go on stage, um, and my classes were all fairly small, um, but the thing is, is you have already won before you go on stage in the sense that you made it this far because there were so many people that did this prep and didn't make it to the stage or they dropped out. So even for us with, you know, COVID, like I know Taylor was in lockdown for like almost half of prep and we were in lockdown here at the beginning of our prep and it was not mentally the most... Um, you know, easy prep, um, especially getting into it and then show being pushed twice and, um, you know, so that's, um, that's all I'll say on the show for now. Um, I do want to sit down and talk about the whole show, go for some clips and kind of things like that, really talk about the feedback that the judge gave me and, um, you know, talk about how I'm feeling when I have a bit of a, a clearer head, um, because I do need to get some water in me now and some food, and, um, I'm not in the best, um, in the best mind, mind space right now to be, be talking about this, but, um, yeah, this was the, um, this was the show day vlog, and I really and truly appreciate it, I haven't even checked my phone yet, um, but I know, I saw on Instagram, there's like, 50 messages there, so I appreciate everyone that's messaged me, wished me good luck, um, anyone who came to the show, watched the live stream, or has supported me at all, or messaged me throughout this prep, um, it truly, truly means a lot, and, um, you know, 
you you don't know like there's been multiple times and I was just having a tough day and someone that I didn't even know messaged me and was like man like you look sick like keep going and it's those little things that make a big difference so I appreciate everyone um, that's followed along on this journey and um, yeah I'm looking forward to what's to come for me next so stay tuned for that and this is this has been the journey to the stage I hope you guys enjoy it and uh, I'll see you in the next video peace